Hey folks, this is the Films of Advanced Age Entertainment here with another topic concerning CGI. Now personally, I don't know much about the history of CGI, but here's something I could tell you. CGI is actually a safety procedure known back in the 80s for a very good reason. Other than being invented, there is one major good reason why it was made up, or at least created, by filmmakers. For one thing, so less people can be in danger of being hurt during productions. The second thing, the real reason why people have been influenced to use CGI more is because of a movie called Twilight Zone the movie. And as her name Vic Morrow tried to save two kids during production, during a very highly dangerous scene where a helicopter fell on top of them, and they got decapitated on camera. Director John Lannis was tried for murder and he was just let go scot-free. However, this is probably the reason why CGI was influenced soon to existence. Mainly because it was much more manageable and put less actors in danger. So now regarding other kinds of art like stop motion and puppetry and suit nation, those are still valid. You can still use those in today's art. Especially independent movies where you can actually get away with that. Many art and movies still use stop motion, even if it's not for monster movies and such stuff. Speaking of which, other foreign movies still use suitmation, especially Japanese kaiju movies. I mean, sometimes you'll see the latest um, kaiju movies even use the suitmation technique. I might be wrong about the latest of the Godzilla and kaiju movies, but who knows, maybe we'll come back. What I do know is that somewhat, maybe, I haven't seen Ultraman Blazar, but I think, I've seen a few clips, but I'm pretty sure they use monster suits too, and that's the latest of the Ultraman series. And that's pretty recent too, seriously, you should probably see it. I mean, I'll have to check again, but I'm sure they use monster suits too, and remember, like I said, that's the latest. So basically, the other arts are not gone, and CGI is valid too, because it's more safe than most other special effects especially when suitmation could get you on fire and stop motion could take a really long time and especially when you can use something like a fin on an actual lizard which is not really a real special effect it's actually just animal abuse so yeah yeah there are some reasons why an actual um non-special effect like that could actually not be considered a special effect anymore because it's actually impacting nature. But if you're actually careful with something that is resourceful in nature, it doesn't impact an actual animal, it could actually age well. Claymation doesn't even have that kind of resource with uh with using actual animals. They just use clay. Yeah, yeah. I sometimes do know that um sometimes animals May sometimes be used for suitmation, but that doesn't exist anymore. They just use like um some sort of latex. One major example I can think of where an animal is actually used for a suit was the cowardly lion from the original, I mean a uh, classic Wizard of Oz movie from nineteen thirty nine by MGM. As shocking as that may sound, the is actually just I think a rumor where they use an actual lion for makeup and uh overall suit of for the guy who played the Cowardly Lion. I find that pretty shocking if it was actually true. Which I hope it isn't because that would make me uh, scream my lungs out. But anyway, that's uh, all I have to say about CGI and how past art can sometimes be used today. But only the ones that are actually necessary to be used today. Yeah, that's all. That's all I wanted to say. So there you go. And there you have it. See you all later and I hope in the next video I make more.